Hello, welcome to the JavaScript tutorial. This is Hassan Mir from 02protraining.com. In this series of video sessions, you will learn how to do the JavaScript programming. So let's start with the overview of JavaScript. So let's start with the basics. What is a JavaScript? It's a programming language and mainly it is used to add functionality to the web pages. It is also used for other purposes than adding functionality to the web pages, for example, to add functionality to desktop widgets and PDF documents. So what is the relationship of JavaScript with Java? The JavaScript does share names and naming conventions with Java. However, both languages have different semantics and they are two different programming languages unrelated to each other. As a matter of fact, JavaScript does borrow lots of its syntax from the C programming language. And the design principles of the JavaScript language are taken from languages called Scheme and Self. Now we're going to talk about high-level attributes of the JavaScript language. If you don't understand any of these, that's totally fine. This is just to give you a high-level overview before we dive deep into the waters. First of all, the JavaScript is a prototype-based programming language. It is a style of object-oriented programming in which classes are not present. Inheritance is performed via a process of cloning existing objects. Second, JavaScript is a scripting language. The scripts are programs that could be written and executed on the fly without explicit compilant link steps. JavaScript is also a dynamic programming language. That means at runtime it can execute common behaviors without need for compilation. And JavaScript is weakly typed. That means different data types could be used intermixed and the JavaScript would do the conversions automatically wherever needed. JavaScript language supports first-class functions. That means functions are objects themselves. They have properties and methods. They could be assigned to variables and passed as arguments. JavaScript is a multi-paradigm language that supports more than one programming paradigm. And one of the paradigm is object-oriented programming. Let's talk about the application of the JavaScript language. It is mostly used to enhance user interface and to create dynamic websites. It is mainly used as client-side scripting language. However, recently its use as server-side scripting language is also getting popular. And most of this popularity is attributed to JavaScript-based virtual machines like Node.js. So this was a very quick high-level overview of the JavaScript language so that you know what it is. Now we are going to go directly hands-on and learn how to program JavaScript. We're going to start with the basics and step by step we're going to learn the complex topic. So at the end of the day you will be the JavaScript programmer.